So the last couple of days have been fucking wonderful, all right? I went to a resort. I went to the resort with Doug. We had a great time. We had a lot. We had great sex, okay? It was so great that I even started considering maybe even getting back with Doug, right? Because at the end of the day, Doug really loves me, okay? So we went to the resort. Everything was great. You guys seen a lot of it where we were having fun. Yeah, sometime Doug is the best friend. Doug is my best friend. I do love him. We've had our ups and downs. But there was like one major problem, and we all know what that is, and that's what it is, okay? Doesn't mean I love him any less or anything like that. Isn't that right, Doug? That's right. That's right. Okay. So, there's a motherfucker on the internet trying to say that um, last night something happened other than this. Last night, I, we, I had been drinking, of course, you know, and this is mainly why I'm fucking sober tonight. I haven't had a drink all day, by the way. Doug? Yes? I said I haven't had a drink all day, by the way. Yes, you haven't had a drink. Well, I know you, I'm just saying, thank you. I'm just saying, this is what happened. Um, I got drunk. I got my feelings hurt because I want Doug to have my back 100 fucking percent through everything, through thick and thin. We had talked the whole time about maybe working on getting back together. Um, the only way that would work is if we were to live together, and we know that. Is that not true? Like, I love the motherfucker, so what can I do? I'm considering it. But there's some things that have to absolutely fucking change. You know what I mean? He might be getting beat up right now. Hang on. Uh, what happened? Uh oh, he had to hang up. Joanne's going off on him. So, anyways, um, did you see how we had to hang up real fast? Here we go. Anyways, last night I got upset because one of my mods had sent me a clip where there was someone was talking about me who wasn't supposed to talk about me. Now, Doug has begged me not to talk about this person, let it go, let everything go. I said, okay, fine, I will. But the entire day this person just sat there and talked. I feel bad. I feel bad for Doug right now. It makes me worry for him. Anyway, long story short, last night, I got upset. We were outside of the hotel uh, talking loud. There was nothing big that happened. Nothing big. If there was something big that happened, we both would be in jail. Yes, the police came. Yes, they said, one of you's got to go. Doug was like, I will go because Doug's a gentleman. Of course, he's going to say that. I said, go ahead. Call Joanne. Call whoever you got to call to go home. So that's what he did. Uh, as soon as he got back to his truck, he called me. We talked for a couple hours. Like, I don't know. He was telling me. Oh, God. Hello? Are you okay? No, I'm still Yeah. Saying, I don't know. A bunch of bullshit was said tonight that I don't even know. They're trying to say that you. There's a clip of you sat, beating up saying, or Joanne or somebody saying that you put your hands on Joanne for eight years. Now it went from that to I'm beating you up to they're told, uh, just, it's going, it's a Huh? People on the internet lie. I know, but it's getting out of hand and then like just then you tell me. You tell me you're okay, and it doesn't sound like you're okay. And this shit's getting put on me like I'm a fucking person out here fucking you around. And I'm, I'm getting pretty upset about it. And I want you to tell all my people right now exactly what I'm saying is true. Are we not? Everything she's saying is true. I'm not beat up. I'm not in the hospital or <laughs> anything like that. Joanne's not beating me up. I'm not in the hospital. <laughs> nobody's, I'm beating, right here. nobody's beating up anybody. Nobody's beating up anybody. Okay, fine. Exactly. <laughs> I don't know where that comes from. This is the internet is fucking crazy. And people make up shit and all that. And that just because they make it up doesn't mean it's true. I know, but it, 
I have this fat buck out here presenting shit, and then he gets screenshots from her, and I'm like, what is going on? Why Why is this being said? And I'm in the dark. I'm like, what? So are you bullshitting me, or is what's going on? So Because I'm getting upset about it. Because as far as I know, you're begging to be back with me and wanting to move in and make it shit work. And I told you that we got a big fucking problem. Uh, there's only one way. If we resolve that problem, then fine. Yep. You're telling me Joanne just wants to forget about it, put everything aside, okay, and I'm willing to do that, but why hasn't that been done yet in three days? I don't know. I mean, all I can say is Joanne's not doing all this. Somebody is posing as her, I swear. And all this shit is bullshit. I just want the drama to end. I just want it to quit. I haven't slept in three days because of this drama. I'm just tired. I'm over all the drama. I'm over all the he said, she said shit. Everything's fine. Everything is wonderful. Nobody's doing anything. It's just the internet trolls. And it's fucking driving me crazy. I, it's just getting fucking old, Doug. It is. It is. So old. I'm so over it all. I just want it to end. It's ruining my life, my friendships, my relationship, everything. And I just want everything to end. Joanne never said I was abusive or anything like that. Wherever that came from is a lie or a troll. She never said any of that. And I went back and I looked at the thing and she can prove it. I can prove it because she has receipts. She never said any of that. That's all a lie. It's all bullshit. I seen everything. I seen screenshots. Everything. And I, I called. I said I am all right. Mate, now that's it. And so that he would back off from all the fucking hate. I'm hurt and I'm in the hospital. All this stuff. I mean, <laughs> it's been crazy. <laughs> I was trying to sleep and I woke up. By all this drama again. And I can assure you it's not Joanne saying anything. Joanne's yeah, supposedly like on Isaac's channel saying differently right this second. So what is going on? Nothing. Nothing. Yes. There's that. Joanne's live on Isaac's channel right now. Saying what? What's she saying? Doug, what is really going on here? Nothing is going on, I swear to God. Nothing is. On my life, nothing is. Can you nothing at least say that did you not fall down the steps at the fucking uh, resort? Yeah, it's going to be everything. Exactly. I don't know what the fuck this is all about. Is she really? Here we go. If you tell me anything, you want to hear the truth? Okay, really? That's her. I don't want to go anywhere. My mileage got broke down on my cart when I got ready to leave. My tires got marked. So it's out of the house. I work third shift, he worked third shift. How many times did I have to work? Not once. He has to me to work. Whoa. I can give you my son's number. He's saying whoa, yet he beats the shit out of his wife. I pay my debt to you. I'm done. I'm done. I'm just, I'm bad. I know. This would have never happened. You know, he don't know this would have never happened if she would have mentioned my baby. So basically, she's saying that Doug controlled her. You guys are hearing this lie. She's threatening to hit him again. What the fuck is going on? Oh 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. I was trying to call me. Oh fuck. Fuck this. Dude, Doug doesn't deserve this. He is a great guy. This is a lie. Hello? Hey. Hello? Just get your shit and my dog and come over. <laughs> She just pissed off Matthew. Everybody's blaming her. She's on there saying that you controlled her for eight years and you couldn't, she couldn't go to the store. You had to take her everywhere. What the fuck? Fuck, Doug? I can't help her. I was eight years ago. Or nine, twelve years ago, whatever. Were you like that? I was, I was controlling his. I've never seen that side of you. Because after a, a relationship, I changed. I changed everything about me. I always do. I learned from my experience to move on. Oh my god. Was, so what? I'm really worked up right now. Say a bunch of shit that's showing me to Dad, this is out of control, dude. It is. Actually, I was controlling with doing it, yes. Why? Because she lied and cheated on you all the time, right? Because, yeah. Because of she's a, she you told with. me because she's a pathological liar who always cheated on you. Yeah, that's what I'm guessing. She did. Okay. Yeah, and I, I was a controlling person. I was very controlling. I look at that now. Oh my I god! I, <laughs> I feel just like you're in over your head over there. I think you should just get my dog, grab something to wear, and just get the fuck out of there. You can come over here. Because I just don't know what's going to happen once you go back in there. She's pretty liquored up. She may hit you again. And blame it on me. Knowing I'm sitting my fat ass here. Yeah, I'm in there again. I'll see all It's like, God damn, people, leave us alone. Leave this alone. I just want everything to be peaceful. Away from the drama, away from the bullshit. Doug, I'm going to have to say this. That I think there there's definitely a line in the sand right now. You can't keep playing both sides. And I feel like at this point you are. Because you tell me one thing, and then when I put Pret and then she's over there squealing. What is really going on? Because you made me believe that. I swear to God, nothing's going on. She's my best friend. You are my best, best friend. I just want everything to be well. I wish you all just get home and talk. And I swear, I mean... I How can I talk to someone who's... Uh, I don't even know her, Doug. I met her. Is this for her five minutes of attention or what? I don't know. She, she just upset right now. So every time she gets upset, she's allowed to squeal and make a ruckus and do what she wants, yeah. smack you, punch you, and... Yet she wants to, like, I don't understand this. I don't either. I mean, she's not very in this hobby on Twitter and all that Well, then tell her to stay the fuck off of it. Like, she's, uh, she's, she's creating her own problems. She's on the phone. There's somebody else out there saying it's her. <clears throat> Done, but she's totally on the phone right now. She's on the phone, yes. Okay, how the fuck are you going to explain this one? That one, uh, I can't explain. <laughs> Doug, this is getting fucking ridiculous, and I'm drawing the line tonight. If you're serious, and you do, and everything you said over the last couple days is fucking legit, then get your shit and come on. Grab whatever, grab my fucking dog. But if you're not, and you're sitting here playing games, and you're playing both I'm sides, playing games. Then, then, then choose, because this is out of hand. I'm serious. I'll go back in there and get my stuff. Then go get your stuff and bring my dog and just come on. I'm done talking about her. I'm done everything. After tonight, I don't want to speak or mention another word. I'm going to block her name from my chat. Uh, I, I don't like any of it. I'll fix everything. No, I don't want you to fix everything. I want you to get uh, get the stuff, get your dog, and come on. Because this is absolutely ridiculous. I know. Seriously, I'm done with it. I've even offered to fucking talk to her 
Instead, she'd rather talk to enemies. So it's starting to look like, what's her motive here? So, I hope you come through and prove to me what you've been saying for the last three days. For the last fucking year, let's be real. All right. Unfucking believable. The police are on their way to Doug, supposedly. Well, he ought to grab his stuff for the night and come on, because this is just out of hand. Yeah. You know what? For the first time in a long time, I can look at a cop and I have had a drink all night and say, this is fucking ridiculous. You guys see firsthand how it goes down. I can't make this shit up. I kind of feel like I'm stuck in the middle. I just don't know what to fucking believe right this second. I'm just like... I want to believe Doug because I've never known Doug to lie to me other than about her. And that's the truth. We'll see. We'll see if he's a lie or not. Hello? What are you doing? Oh, my God. This is all just... I'm getting text messages and text messages. Shit. This is just bullshit. I'm so I just want to go to bed and forget all this. You just want to stay there with her, huh? All right. I just want to go to bed right now. Look, you made your choice tonight. You make your choice. Like, do what you got to do. Yeah, you have. Because you're not going to keep lying to me, Doug. It's obvious from text. I'm not lying to you. I'm not lying to you. Then what the fuck? I'm not lying to anybody. I swear to God. This is just out of control. I'm over it. I can't handle all this drama. Yeah, well, I feel like if you really love me and everything that you said were true, then you would already have been here. Or you'd be on your way. You wouldn't be sitting there trying to comfort her. Well, I'm here alone. The person you supposedly love. So what is it? Do you still love her? Is there something going on? I do love you. I do love you. Then then what's the deal? I don't know. It's still fucking calls. Well, yeah, your fucking number's out there. What do you expect? I just need to fucking sleep. You know what, Doug? I just feel like I'm just kind of done with it, too, and I think this is it. I love you, but I gotta walk away from you at this point. It's too deep. Do what you gotta do to protect your house and her and all that. I'm done. Don't contact me anymore. Don't talk to me. I'm staying in front of a room of 1.2K people. Don't fuck with me no more. I love you, but I'm done. What? I said I love you, but I'm done. So, yeah. She didn't mean to put my number out there. It's by accident. I don't care if she meant to or not. That's not my concern. My concern is why you're still there and not here. I don't want everybody to quit. Okay, and... I do too, but... I do love you. I love you with all my heart. Then why aren't you here, I'm sorry for all this. I'm too tired to drive. I'm too tired to... I can't even hardly lift my head right now. Doug, take care of yourself, bud. All right? Please, if you ever loved me or gave a fuck about me at any point, you will not talk to me. Do not email me. Nothing. I'm done. Sell your story on me. Do what you got to do. I'm not selling uh, I'm not doing I'm done, anything. Doug. I'm done. She's not there. I'm done. You got your way. You got what you fucking want. I feel really played. My friendship's I... not going anywhere. Huh? My friendship's not going anywhere. No, this relationship just... is. Ours is. You decided tonight. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. <laughs> Doug, I'm going to tell you again. Don't contact me anymore. All right? Take care of yourself. Do what you got to do. Do what you and her got to do to hurt me, too. I'm fine with that. I will recover. I'm not going to do anything. Take care of yourself by... Well, that's that. (laughs) What that is that, you guys? Heartbreaking. I believed in him more than that. I really did.